In Texas, a bizarre development in the stabbing deaths of two young boys. Officials have now charged their mother with the murders. She says an intruder committed the murders, but police have compiled enough evidence to charge her with the crimes. The national press descended upon Rowlett. See, in Texas, a housewife. In Texas, a mother who claimed that an intruder killed. What could make a mother kill her own children? It doesn't make any sense at all. 26-year-old woman, perfectly happy, no criminal record, no history of abuse, no history of any kind of psychotic disorder, nothing. Suddenly, grabs a butcher knife and destroys her own children. I mean, the first time I had a speeding ticket for going like five miles over the speed limit was about six months before this had happened. I had never been in any trouble. The media coverage of Darley Routier did not happen in a vacuum. It occurred one year after the verdict on Susan Smith. I would like to say to whoever has my children that they please, I mean, please bring them home. Susan Smith told police that some black man had hijacked her car and driven away with her two sons in it. It has now been seven days since Michael and Alex Smith disappeared. Nothing has turned up, but authorities show no signs of giving up the search. The South Carolina community was grieving. They put on lengthy countywide searches, and then they realized they had been duped. Susan Smith has confessed to murdering her two young boys. For nine days, she told that lie before finally breaking down and admitting to law enforcement that she had let her car roll into the waters of John D. Long Lake with those children strapped inside in their car seats. Susan Smith has been arrested and will be charged with two counts of murder. This was one of the biggest stories of the year. With the enormous sense of outrage and betrayal felt by the citizens of Union, South Carolina. To feel like she had duped everyone led to a national fury. The Susan Smith case absolutely shocked the nation. In fact, Time Magazine put her picture on its cover with the headline, How Could She? There had just never been anything like this. What made the Susan Smith case so defining was how much media attention she had received in announcing what had happened to her kids. When that story was proven to be false, this went from being an eight or a nine to an 11. So 11 months later, here comes the murder of Darley's sons. And everyone is thinking, this was the Dallas version of Susan Smith. There are unavoidable comparisons with Susan Smith. Susan Smith claimed they were abducted by a man. Routier insisted that an unknown intruder attacked her and the children and got away. I said, she just snapped. She's another Susan Smith, is what they told me. They used those words? Yes. But you have to remember, she confessed. Darley didn't. Tunnel vision occurs when an investigator gets a sense, a theory, of a case and can't really leave the lanes that are created by that vision. It was very clear early on that the police believed Darley had killed her children and that was going to be the focus of their investigation. A normal mother, just normal like everybody else, doesn't go to sleep and all of a sudden just snap and become a psychotic maniac killer. Oh, that hurt. There isn't anybody who could have heard her reaction, her scream, could ever believe she had anything to do with that. that wasn't, that was real. 
100% real. My babies are dying in the shed! How could anybody not listen to that tape and think that that's not real? That, that tape is, it's devastating. Hold on, honey. Hold on. Hold on. You're telling me that a person who is normal, not violent, no mental illness, could cold-bloodedly kill her own children for absolutely no reason whatsoever. Doesn't make any sense to me. If I had done this to my children, I would be the first person to stand up and say, oh my God, I need help. What have I done? You couldn't, a mother couldn't live with herself. At what point did you understand that you yourself were under suspicion? The day that they arrested me. Investigators from the Rowlett Police Department arrested Darlie Routier. Darlie Routier was charged with two counts of capital murder. If convicted, she could face the death penalty.